Alright, so this is going to basically show how to add an image to a product that's already uploaded. Uh, so in this case, we're going to go ahead and take a look at the uh, product itself. Um, so we're going to go down to Vision Fitness and Exercise Bikes, uh, Vision R2200. And we see this product is listed right here. Uh, so we basically want to add an image. So not this image here, but this image down here is actually the product image. Um, so we want to make this something uh, that people could see what it is, that kind of thing. All right. So we're going to go ahead and change that. Uh, so the first thing we want to do is we want to upload the image to the site. So we're going to go to the FTP. All right, so we go here. I already have the image in here in this folder. So this is the image here. Uh, it's labeled uh, Power Inlet. And uh, on this side, we just want to choose the folder. So in this case, I want to put this in the CRM folder. So open that up. All right, and I'm just going to go ahead and upload that. So I right click and then hit uh, Upload. All right. So now the image is, the image should be in the uh, folder on the web. Next thing we want to do is go ahead and uh, add the image to the back end. So we want to go to the back end here. Um, I already have this product here already, which was created. So we're going to go ahead and edit it. If you look here, this is the uh, power inlet for the Vision R2200 so that's the one we want to edit so we're going to go ahead and uh, press this button over here it says E and that's for edit All right. so now we have the details that we added earlier for the uh, for the product um, so we're just going to scroll down to the bottom here okay so this is where you would add the image um, you can basically grab the image from here uh, using uh, uh, this uh, button right here so you can grab that image um, and uh, do it like that um, the way I usually do it is to just add the file here so uh, all this stuff here is standard so we don't have to worry about changing any of this so for example if you want to remove the image you can press that here but we don't want to do that um, but uh, we want to add an image. So I'm going to go down here where it says uh, select an existing image from the from server file. So we already uploaded the image. We know where it is. Right? We're just going to put the uh, name of the image here. So it's called uh, Power Inlet dash, uh, Vision 2200 HRT5 JPEG. JPG. All right? And uh, just to pause here a little bit, I'm just going to go back to the uh, FTP right if we come in here we look into look in the files on the site uh, we can see uh, the image all right so let's see if we can find it on the on the site here all right I'm just gonna cross scroll down a little bit okay all right so here it is here, so it was uploaded. It's the same name as what we're trying to put in right now. So it's already on the site, uploaded. We just gotta tell the back end where to find it. Alright, so let's just go back there. Just gonna go back here. Alright. So if we look here, this is the same same uh, name that we just looked at just now on the FTP. Alright, put that in. Now this right here is very important. You have to change this here based on where you uploaded the image earlier because that's where it's going to look for it so if you remember we did CRM so we go down to CRM right and we load that all right so this image is going to be, be uh, looking for I mean the uh, the site is going to be looking for this image in the CRM folder all right so everything looks good we're just going to go ahead and preview that all right now this right here, a lot of times this doesn't come up with the actual image, which it should. It just comes up like this. Um, so this is not something that I would worry about initially, unless 
on the front end it doesn't show alright so once we okay with that we'll just press update alright and then in order to see if it's this is working we can go up here and go back to the site and then we're just gonna refresh this alright now we have the image here that we just uploaded uh, to the site there's a bigger picture of it there alright and uh, that's basically how you upload an image to the website